This is an x-ray of a term infant who was born after fairly uneventful circumstances with good APGARs of 9 and 9, but then developed respiratory distress and had this x-ray done. If you aren't familiar with x-rays, there's a real big abnormality on this one. You can see over here, there's some darkness, some blackness up here, and this looks like something, this white wedge, that's called an angel wing sign. This is a sign of something called a pneumothorax and a chest tube was inserted to drain it. After the chest tube was inserted, the child though continued to deteriorate and over the course of about 24 hours, although the chest tube was draining, something happened, which was quite remarkable. These are two CT scans of the chest. The first one, B1, is on day one, which shows that black collection of air around the heart. The heart is the big white blob up top. Now, on day two, you can see that the amount of blackness or air had expanded greatly and was now completely surrounding the heart. At the same time, the infant was experiencing bradycardia, a very low heart rate, which was life-threatening. So they decided to do something that I've never seen done. What they did was not just have the one chest tube in, they put a second tube in. That is in the mediastinum or the central part of the chest surrounding the heart. This was life-saving by allowing blood flow back to the heart from compressed blood vessels. I'm happy to tell you that this child not only survived, but did very well and was discharged healthy from the unit. The question is, what really happened here? In the mediastinum, which is the area surrounding the heart, there are blood vessels, large venous vessels, which are easily compressible, the superior vena cava being one of them and the inferior vena cava being another. With the high pressure in the mediastinum from that collection of air, these vessels became compressed, limiting blood return to the heart. As blood return to the heart fell, the cardiac output dropped and this baby started to develop a low heart rate. I have never in my career placed a mediastinal chest tube. However, the surgeon that did this saved this baby's life and is another reminder that they certainly heal with steel.